What's up everyone, this is your Daily Techie here with a review on the application MovieBox. Before we get started, I do want to let you know that MovieBox is uh, for jailbreaking devices through Cydia. So I'm going to go ahead and do this on my press play here. This is a recorded video that I've already done on my iPad. I did not have audio, so I had to transfer it to my computer. Then we're going to watch the video and I'm going to walk you through the review. And my applications are in alphabetical order, so I'm going to go to M, MovieBox. MovieBox is a application a lot like Netflix but with a lot more new movies as you can see immediately it has Ted, Identity Thief, Jack Reacher, Gangster Squad, Broken City, The Host, bunch of new movies, Project X. I'm going to go ahead and click on Project X to show you the layout of it. As you can see you have a watch later feature, download, watch now, 360, 480, and 720, the language you can have in English and Russian. And then at the bottom you have a trailer that's from YouTube just in case you want to know what the movie's about so it's a really nifty app I went ahead and added that to my library by the way and I'm back to movies I'm going to keep, keep scrolling down to show you some of the new movies uh, Zero Dark Thirty is out there, Here Comes a Boom obviously a lot more I'm just not able to read that fast Men in Black, Lorax, the, uh, the Lincoln movie now I'm at TV shows, I have a lot of TV shows um, this application is amazing because you no longer have to go to Amazon and buy all these TV shows that come out you don't have to buy anything from your Xbox to the Microsoft website or anything like that. This is my library. As you can see, I immediately have a lot of TV shows, movies. My fiance downloads movies on here as well. Number 23, Unknown, Benjamin Button, The Mighty Ducks, Click, Wreck-It Ralph, The Abraham Lincoln Vampire uh, movie. Then you go to news. What this is is when things are updated as far as like the movies go. If there's a new movie added or there's a new TV show added, it'll add up there. As you can see, the bottom left-hand corner it says updating. Once that's finished, my news feed will uh, download new movies and new TV shows. So as you can see, I go back to movies. I'm gonna go ahead and give you this uh, demonstration on searching. I go to Lion King, and as you can see, it already has uh, the Lion Kings available for you. And then I believe I'm about to go ahead and check out the years. You can sort by year. I'm going to click on 2013 just to show you the movies that have been released in 2013 that are on this application. And as you notice, the right of the year, there's genre if you want to look up horror movies or action or whatever. And I'm back to my library. some of the things I have in my library. I, I believe you can max out the library to you know a couple hundred if I'm, I'm not sure. I at least have like 60 uh, TVs and movie shows on there. I'm going to Dexter and I'm going to uh, select on season 4. Like I said they have all the seasons and all the shows of every uh, TV show that they have on here. I click on episode 4. I'm going to stream in 480 just because of the fact that my internet connection is not that great. So it's not the best for me to uh, stream in 720 because it takes about 10 minutes for it to buffer correctly. And as you notice, what I'm going to do is, as soon as it starts, he's going to be holding a blood sample, but I'm going to pause it. So it'll load up a minute and press play. And usually when you do that, you can stream the whole time, so you're not going to be buffering. You won't have any problems. It'll be, you know, really amazing. As you can see, he's holding up the blood sample like I told you about earlier. And <coughs> I don't have any audio from my iPad, as I said earlier, so you're not going to hear anything from this. But when you have your own movie box, of course, you'll hear everything. Um, everything will be you know great for you as you can see the news bubble popped up 17 that means there are 17 things added as far as movies and TV shows I can go ahead and see that uh, there was a new move a new TV show added on game Game of Thrones in the bottom right hand corner I know a lot of people like Game of Thrones this is a really good app I you know I strongly encourage you to get it as you can see I'm gonna go ahead and go into Cydia here I want to let you know this was my first time starting up Cydia today so it took a while for everything to load up and some application uh, some ads started saying I had spyware on my computer on my iPad didn't make sense and I'm gonna go ahead and show you to how to search for it it's gonna be movie space box as you can see I made a typo area here the first time I put a movie box in search and nothing came up for like the whole you know, a couple seconds. And here I am waiting like an idiot, so I backspace, then put movie box in. It does take a minute to load up because I'm loading up my changes. If you're familiar with City every day you log in, there the changes are downloaded to the City application. 
So as you can see, the top three are the MovieBox applications from different sources. Uh, there's um, Buy Your Apple, Insane, iHome Repo, and I use the iHome Repo. And that's just to show you that those app, the that the movie box application is available for those. And basically, that app is a really strong app. I'm really satisfied with it. I use it all the time. I'm probably going to even uh, cancel my subscription to Netflix because of that application. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and put the sources, uh, my source I used, on the uh, description. So that way, you, if you don't have that source, you can go ahead and put it in your Cydia and download the uh, MovieBox application. And then that way you can save money. So give this uh, video a like and subscribe. And thank you for watching.